friends, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a little bit different, something I've never done before, but if you don't know me like super personally or close, you may not know that I paint and draw. Okay, I used to paint and draw for a few years and then I just kind of stopped. I haven't in a couple of years since before Zara was born. So I just had the idea for my daughter's birthday that I would paint her a picture for above her bed, or her crib. And I just was feeling really inspired having gone to the art museum and just life in general. I'm like, ah, oh, I kind of have like the drawing painting mojo in me. So I need to take advantage of it. Cause if I don't have it, I do not draw. Like I have to feel inspired and it just hasn't come to me like in a while. So it has this past week. So I thought I would paint my daughter a picture for her room for her birthday. And since her birthday is like a pool theme party type of thing, I'm like, implementing flamingos into it so I thought I would paint her a flamingo drawing now I did like a couple watercolor sketches that's what I'm going to be using today is watercolor and I did three well, I first drew it out and then I watercolored them and I really liked the last one the best I have her right here with me by the way can you say hi she's eating a snack and I like the last one the best, so I'm going to take that and blow it up onto a bigger one. So I'm repainting it again. So we'll see how it goes. I'm staring at my big piece of paper right now. It's just a big piece of watercolor that I got from Hobby Lobby. It was like five bucks and then I used the 40% off coupons. So it was like $3. So yeah, if you like these kind of videos or end up liking this or like the flamingo that I draw, definitely give this video a big old thumbs up. And hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss any of my bonus videos that I have going on this week. This week is my daughter's birthday, so I'm doing a bunch of videos and extra videos for you guys in celebration of her. I'm just really excited, but it's also a bittersweet thing. Anyways, let's just go ahead and get started.
All right, there it is, the flamingo. I don't know how I feel about it. Leave in the comments below if you think I should redo it because I feel like it kind of looks like a swan peacock flamingo. What do you think? She's eating food. Okay, I also messed up as you saw in the video as well. I dropped my paintbrush and so I like counteracted that with like some splatter and then I messed up on the leg. I wanted it to be longer and so I kind of messed up there. I don't know guys, what do you think? Should I do it again? Mm, I'm probably gonna do it again. I mean, this paper was not that expensive. It was literally $3, so it wasn't that big of a deal. But I thought it would be kind of fun still to show you guys the process of how I painted this flamingo and my process on how I like to watercolor. So if you like these kind of videos and would wanna see more of them, definitely let me know and hit that thumbs up button. And again, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join the subby fam over here. I would love to have you. And I will see you guys later on this week. Bye.